Now, if you have a file like this one in your machine, then it simply means that you have successfully downloaded uh, CM Simple. And the next step from here is to extract the contents of this zip file to see what's in there. So I'm going to extract to CM Simple, same folder. And it's done. So this is my readable folder now. Let's get in there again. So this is our CMS website. So I'm going to go back one step and rename this to uh, a more friendly URL. I'm simply going to call it simple, like so. So from here, I'm going to take this uh, folder, simply copy it to our htdocs um, folder, because for these tutorials, we're using XAMPP as our local host server. And again, if you do not know how to use XAMPP or how to download XAMPP, please refer to the Joomla section uh, to the lectures which says downloading XAMPP and installing XAMPP. So assuming that you know, I'm going to head over to where we installed XAMPP, which is D, then XAMPP. And our server is in htdocs, so I'm going to get in there and simply paste in my folder. Now remember, on a live server, you'll be pasting this folder to your um, public dash HTML using a, um, an FTP application or the file manager of your control panel or uh, whatever that you use with your host. So now that this uh, simple folder is in our htdocs, which is the server, let us um, start XAMPP, control panel here, yeah, XAMPP. Then I'm simply going to start Apache. Now, uh, CM Simple is a great CMS which does not require a database. So I'm not going to uh, start MySQL, our database. I'm only going to start Apache, which is the web server. Now, from here, I'm going to access our CMS under the domain, which is uh, localhost then slash simple. And there is our CM Simple website. Now we have seen that we, we didn't set up a database. We simply installed it on the server and uh, there it is, it's up. So the next step is to log in actually and um, change the password from the default password to a password that we will remember. So uh, on the bottom here, there is a tab which says login, simply click on it and user you can leave it blank then on the password the default is test so simply hit test then log in and welcome to cm simple administration area so from here we'd want to go where it says settings just point and on this drop down menu click on cms here where it says password simply take out everything and put a password that you will remember then hit save. Okay, so it has been saved. Uh, if you try to continue, it's going to log you out because the password has changed. So again, you simply click on login, then uh, input the new password that you created, like so. And again, update. So again, you are back into the um, administrative area of CM Simple. Now that's how you install CM Simple, that's how you change your password, and that concludes this lecture.